Hi everybody, Alex Abreu here from Expert Forex and in today's video I just want to share some ideas about trading other people's money but these ideas also apply to your own trading, your own normal trading because people that trade other people's money apply the disciplines required for you to make a long-term success of your trading career. So the principles apply to ordinary traders as well as proprietary traders. Proprietary traders are essentially people that trade other people's money. And as you know, this is open to all traders. The facility to trade other people's money is now readily available to all traders. So a lot of my videos are actually stimulated by emails that I receive during the a particular day or comments that are made our, in our forum. So here's an example of a comment that was made recently and the person basically says that uh, the only people that succeed take huge risks and earn 10% in one day and then just stop trading. That's, that is one of the ways you can you can qualify as a proprietary trader but obviously that kind of thing is not maintainable and then the other the reason he calculated is that uh, people have to be super scalpers with extremely small stops and risk small amounts and then their success rate will help them and their risk return ratio would be in the region of three to four times. And then a further comment that is made, uh, the dream of an automated EA that passes every time is a dream and that you, you are required to do manual intervention all the time. So there's a whole lot of stuff that gets said in this comment. And as you can see, it is basically saying, hey, mates, you are wasting your time with this proprietary trading. You're wasting your time if you think automatic robots can do it. And you need super, super luck or super success rates to succeed. Now, I've just recently woken up to the proprietary trading opportunity that is out there and I thought I'd give it a go. So I did a free trial and I, and I traded eight days out of the 10 days or out of the five days. You only need required for the free trial to trade five days and I traded eight days and the objective was to earn a return of 5% over 10 days and also not lose more than 5% over those 10 days. And I achieved that and I trade very actively, 188 positions and I traded a lot of positions. Now why so many? Because I used a robot. I actually used the Make Money Day Trader robot to trade these, these trading. So my success rate is 50%. So you don't need this 80% or 90% success rate. I did 53% success rate. Very normal. <laughs> then what really did it was I had a risk return ratio of 1 to 1.1. So what that means is for every $1 I risk, I made $1 and 10 cents. So again, the risk return ratio wasn't as mentioned in the previous slide three or four times. It was just marginally better than what I was risking. And when that happens, your your gains are slightly bigger than your losses. Actually, they're just slightly bigger. So a really normal success rate with a very small gains but bigger than the losses is all you need to succeed. And then the total profits were, were reached over that period. It shows you you can succeed with absolutely normal trading ratios, nothing exceptional. So let's go on to my response. So yeah, I say I passed the FMO tr uh, trial using the make money day trader on a set and forget. In other words, I just left it for 10 days and it traded with no man in intervention because something that was mentioned in that comment, you need to constantly intervene with these robots. And I traded the CAD, which is, uh, as you know from a previous video, the most reliable currency to trade this way. 
and I traded 188 transactions. But it was my very first try and I just didn't say, oh, let me take a chance because this is a free trial. I did a lot of homework to work out exactly what is required to pass the trial. I just didn't say, oh, well, you know, I know a bit about trading. Let me go take a chance. I, had, I worked out my, my position sizing, my stops, my targets, uh, the time of day that I had to trade, all of those things I did a lot of homework on. And uh, you will notice that my success rate was 53%, really quite poor, uh, and my risk return rate was uh, 1 to make 1.1. So nothing spectacular came out of this. But the real secret, now this is the objective of this video, is to impose to tell you, and I can't explain, there isn't a formula I can give you. The real secret is to have perfect position sizing. Now, what I mean by that, I've, I've traded 188 transactions. If my position sizing was less than what I actually used, I would not have reached my target. I, I think that's pretty clear. But the opposite applies. If it was more then I uh, used, there is the possibility that I would have got stopped out. It just depends on the timing of the successful deals and, and, and the unsuccessful ones. So, so the real success of proprietary trading is actually an unspoken item. It is to have perfect position sizing. It's, it's, that skill is the most untaught skill because it is very difficult to teach. There is no formula. You build that skill up from experience. All right, so the sample of one proves that firstly, it is possible, but not easy to use a automated robot to trade propriety trading, uh, trading money. But if it was easy, it would not be a challenge and skilled traders would not be justly rewarded for their skills. So that you must understand that forex trading is not about making it easy for everybody. It's about rewarding skilled traders. And we all know that only about 5% of all traders are in that category. But when you're in that category, you get very well rewarded. So uh, just a bit of uh, philosophy that I've got here. One has to keep an open mind with these things and not create or give theoretical obstacles too much energy. Like this guy that was posting, he was just saying, this is why it's impossible. You will never do this thing. You need these kind of performance ratios. I've just proven that that's completely hogwash. One of my mentors told me, Always expose yourself to the danger of success often. In other words, if you don't try often, you will never know if you can succeed. Now, again, don't sit around doing little sums and calculations and all that to prove that you shouldn't be trying something. Jump in and do it and it will teach you what you're doing wrong. Because if you don't succeed, you are doing something wrong and it will teach you. And a lot of people don't know that perfect position sizing is actually the key to proprietary trading. All of this other stuff doesn't really matter. You can have a success rate of 40% and if your risk return ratio is good, you can still succeed. You can uh, do the opposite. You can have a success rate of 70 and if your risk return ratio is okay, you'll succeed. But perfect position sizing is something that you need to teach yourself and that is the real key. And a lot of pr proprietary traders that have succeeded will know this without knowing it. Now, the other thing that I really like about these proprietary trading firms is they give you this fantastic feedback on how you're doing, how you close are you to meeting your objectives and that type of thing. And as you can see, all the information is provided to you. It monitors your daily progress. It actually even monitors your uh, trade by trade and it gives you all the statistics that you need to make sure that you're on the right track. And before I forget, I briefly mentioned that I used the Make Money the Day Trading Robot. These robots have been designed to cater for disciplined traders who want to control their risk return ratios, their position sizing, their daily profit and loss figures and that kind of thing. These day traders have been designed for discipline traders and they can obviously also be used for proprietary trading because 
of the enhanced risk control built into the EAs. If you want more information about them, just use the links provided here, or there will be clickable links in the description of the video as well as in the commentary of the video. Now, I hope you've enjoyed this video and that you've learned a little bit about the critical issues that will make a successful proprietary trader, one that trades other people's money. You can become one too if you can meet those trading ratios and most importantly, can teach yourself how to position size your trades successfully. For more information, just click on the links provided uh, to see uh, how you can become a proprietary trader. So from me, Alex Deploy, cheerio.